hey what's up fam welcome back to the channel so we're about to head into this dollar tree so i was reading an article it said that the worst days to shop here and the best days to shop here and why um let me know in the comments what you think the worst days of the week to shop at any store especially a dollar tree store um the article is saying the weekends are the worst because most people are off on the weekends and also that um it's more crowded although they do have tend to have extra staff some stores don't the lines are extremely long some dollar trees that i go in have now started putting a six foot distance <laughs> back on the floors so i don't know what's up with that but we're going to go into the store um trying to see how to flip it around hey lydia hey wavy how are you I haven't been to this store in probably over six months. I keep forgetting this one over here. I see some garden stuff out. Uh, they got some micro seeds right here, your micro greens. Flowers and soil. Oh, and they got these pots back out these stackables to grow in I don't know if I'm getting anything but I'm gonna get this just in case so this store doesn't seem to have a lot of people here but they do have a lot of product on the shelves so far they got the flip-flops out. It's like 70, what is it, 73 degrees here today? In some areas, some areas is 67. It still feels good. I went for um, a 30-minute walk. Oh, look at the bunnies up there, y'all. Hey, Cassandra, how are you? They got all these nice pots. And things for your garden. I bought one of these. I can't even find it. But I said I was going to use mine to hang my broom and stuff on. Right They got hanging pots in here. It's 75 in um, South Carolina. Okay. That's some good hot weather. Well, not super hot, because South Carolina can get really hot. That's my home place. Okay. I can't wait to show y'all this surprise that I have coming at the end of the month. Hmm. Party stuff. My daughter's, my youngest daughter's birthday is in April. She will be 18, y'all. 18. And she lets me know that every day almost. Baskets in here too for organization or growing in because I have grown in some of these things before, like stuff like this. It's deep enough to grow in. They're stocked on paper towels. Tissues, toilet paper, this little four. I mean, it's very little on the roll, but it's a dollar twenty-five. You on a budget, you can get that. 
Let's see what's up here. Candles. Some home decor. Oh, this is the three and five dollar owl. Some shirts. Socks. Laundry detergent and cleaning supplies. These are $1.25. I'm guessing this whole owl is five or three dollars. The thing says five here, but on here it says three dollars. Oh, this is what I wanted for my pineapples, but I need this one. These are five dollars. Um, let me see if I can prop y'all up because I need to get that. favorite color if any of y'all can. Nobody really commenting, but I see 119 people in here. So can y'all please give me a thumbs up for this video? It does help the channel grow. Right now, I only have 23 thumbs up. Why y'all watching and not liking? It's free. Help a girl out. Oh, this is cute. on the food aisle in a minute y'all I'm just taking a look around oh they got these for five dollars Easter stuff oh thank y'all for hitting the like I'm at 40 likes with 129 of y'all in here I appreciate y'all I was looking to see if they had the distance signs over by the cashier, but I don't see it in here. But a different um, Dollar Tree that I went and they had it, I could probably take y'all to that one a different day. This was just impromptu. I had a different video for today, but I decided to do a live instead. So this is what arts and crafts stuff. Oh yeah. This is cute. This could be like my husband's truck. I could hang towels on this, hang this over the door in the bathroom. Let me get it, but I think about it as I'm walking. I should have been in the garden working with the day being like today, but I needed to go walking. So here's the food section.
Thank you, um, um, Michael. I will. I appreciate it. Looking a little empty. Got some gaps going on up in here. Refrigerated section. food now, spices, creamers, coffee, sugar, chef stable milk down here, almond, oat, and 2%, some cereals, Tarts and muffins and stuff, dollar twenty-five. Now their Jiffy corn mix though is seventy-five cent. Jellies, peanut butter, all $1.25. So, I mean, you can still get things at a decent price. Like, I don't eat a lot of peanut butter, although I store peanut butter because when my son is home, he eats a lot of peanut butter, especially when he's working out. Um, but these little ones right here, these would work good for him to keep in his room. Although I have the little um, travel ones that he uses in his room. Now, let me tell you, I would get this because this has gone up in price in a regular store. Even though this is not a lot on here, that's still a good bit for $1.25. Hey, Shatika. How are you today? And they got paper plates and cups and stuff over here. Oh, wait. I think I has something I wanted to get. Need some more of this. As y'all enter, please hit the like button. It's getting there. I'm trying to get at least 100 likes. I'm only at 57 likes right now, but it's over 150 people in here. Some nice little cups. I say little because it don't look like you could have much coffee in it or tea in it. But they're cute. The color of them are cute. And it's heavy. Some bowls. Oh, I know what my husband said I needed to do. Do they have it in here that I can use it? Because I'm juicing today, not eating, just juicing. And I'm I didn't make any extra, but he was saying I should. No, not that one. I don't think that would freeze well. But like get a container or something when I have extra to put in there and put it in the freezer. Owl I need to be on, but I'm gonna go on the candy owl. Oh, I didn't know Snickers had a cookie dough. I wonder if my husband would like it. Okay, 
Because my daughter got me the wrong thing the other day. I should go by. So they have canvas in here for $1.25. That um, okra, tomato, and corn and stuff. All that stuff is cheaper, I think, than Walmart. Um, now you still can find probably green beans for cheaper in Walmart, but mostly everything else in here is cheaper than Walmart. And it looks like it's the same size. Thank you, Michael, for asking people to hit that like button. Hey, Carol. Well, I make my own now, Carol. I don't even buy it anymore. And it tastes so much better. I do have a video on it. On both of my channels, honestly. They have the peas in here, the rice in here. $1.25 for this right here. This is two pounds. It doesn't look like it, but it feels like it. It's very heavy. Two pounds for $1.25. You can't beat that. That's the number of meals. Because it don't take a lot for rice. Because it's going to swell up when you're cooking it. And then if you don't know how to make your pizza dough, you can buy you some for $1.25. But I love my piece of dough that I that I make. I said I was gonna try it as just a roll, cause it's just so fluffy. Lemon juice. I was trying to see if they had any apple cider vinegar. I just got the regular vinegar. This is not the one I need. I need the the mother. Not this one, but this is a big size right here for $1.25. It's 32 fluid ounce. Okay. That's not bad. We got over here drinks and stuff. <sighs> Movie theater popcorn. Let's see. Hair care stuff over here. They had towels and stuff in here. What's this? Oh, uh, charcoal face cleaner. Um, my daughter probably needed this because she was trying to take her makeup off. Just gotta remind her, don't flush this crap down my toilet. They have Dove soap in here. Okay. I am mad at it. Other soaps and shampoos and body wash up in here. Some are coming. Well, I would say keep it in your car, but it'll melt. It'll melt. You get pads in here. Dollar twenty-five still. Mm, makeup. I wouldn't buy makeup out of the dollar store, but I guess you could. <clears throat> Let's see. Got some leaves. Ibuprofen, like Tylenol, the generic version up here. Other pain relief stuff. You can just easily stock this stuff up and put it in, you know, a little container, a tote or something, and have it for your first aid stuff. Because I have medication with my first aid stuff. Um, it makes sense to have pain medicine with your first aid even stuff like the liquid skin and if you don't want to do that you can do like a 
uh, super glue or something, like the Gorilla Glue. That helps. And then I also keep the pourable kind of the hydrogen peroxide and the um, alcohol. But I also, oh, they got green alcohol in here too, y'all. But I also keep like the spray kind as well. Okay, Tom, you're knocking stuff down. what I was looking for. I don't see it in here because I know I'm going to need it for what I'm getting at the end of the month. I'm probably going to have to get it out of Walmart though because I don't see it. Okay. Okay. I think I've been on every aisle. Yeah, I think I have because that's arts and crafts. Oh, I didn't show you because the lady was over there. The emergency stuff. Well, I say emergency stuff, but, you know, making sure you have extra chargers and little lights that you can put in certain places to, you know, light that area up, but don't want it really bright. So, yeah, I just wanted to do a quick video. And since I'm not going to get my 100 likes that I wanted to get, I'm going to get off. I'm not going to sit here and keep working hard. And I'm underappreciated. I appreciate the ones who did. But... Why am I over here with this candy? I'm debating if I want to make Easter baskets for my grands or if I just want to buy them. Huh? It's just a thought. It's just a thought. I didn't see any other seeds in here, though. All they had was micro greens. Are they over here? No. Guess I don't have any. There's some more flower pots right here. Those are cute. So are the frogs. Anyway, y'all. Thanks for coming. I appreciate those who support 100%. And I appreciate those who are even watching. And I will see y'all in the next video tomorrow probably two or three videos so i will see you then y'all take care love you guys